This fish can zap a horse into next week, and it's not even trying hard. One jolt equals 860 volts. That's 10 times your wall socket, enough to stop a human heart. An apex predator that hunts not with teeth or claws, but with raw electricity. Meet the electric eel, nature's lightning bolt. Welcome to Kingdom Animalia. Today we're diving headfirst into the murky waters of South America to meet the electric eel, the OG lightning rod of the animal kingdom. Forget Marvel villains, this eight foot long fish, yes, fish, will bust that eel lie in a minute. Packs enough juice to light up your entire house while swimming. This is a creature that hunts with electricity, navigates like a stealth submarine, and, believe it or not, can shock itself on purpose to stay warm in winter. Despite the name, the electric eel isn't an eel at all. It's closer to a catfish than the slippery ocean eels you might imagine. Its long, snake-like body, sometimes stretching over eight feet, earned it the name. But in reality, this creature belongs to a completely different family of fish. Found in the murky waters of the Amazon and Orinoco rivers, its strange appearance and shocking abilities have baffled scientists for centuries. But if its name is misleading, its power is very real. And that power comes from an extraordinary design hidden beneath its skin. The electric eel is basically a living battery. Inside its body are thousands of specialized cells called electrocytes. Think of them like stacked batteries in a flashlight, each one tiny, but when linked together, they can unleash a massive current. When the eel wants to strike, its brain sends a signal that flips these cells on like switches, releasing up to 600 volts of electricity. That's more than enough to stun a struggling fish, scare off predators, or even knock an unlucky human flat. Unlike most hunters that rely on speed, claws, or sharp teeth, the eel's greatest weapon is invisible and instantaneous. But this electricity isn't just for attack. The eel has another shocking trick up its sleeve. In the muddy rivers where electric eels live, visibility is close to zero. Eyesight is almost useless. So instead of seeing their prey, electric eels sense them with electricity. They emit small, low-voltage pulses like a natural radar system, mapping their environment in the dark. Every object in the water bends the electric field slightly, and the eel can feel those changes like a sixth sense. But when the moment is right, the eel doesn't just sense, it strikes. In a split second, it unleashes a high-voltage blast that paralyzes its prey. Tiny fish are frozen mid-swim, twitching helplessly as the eel moves in for the kill. It's hunting, but with pure electricity instead of teeth and claws. And sometimes, the eel doesn't just stun its prey, it controls it. The electric eel isn't satisfied with just zapping its prey. It can actually puppet other animals with its electricity. Scientists discovered that when the eel sends out short bursts of current, it forces the muscles of nearby fish to contract. In other words, the eel can make its prey twitch against its will, revealing its hiding spot. Even more incredible, the eel can fire rapid, machine-gun-like pulses that cause prey to spasm uncontrollably, leaving them stunned and defenseless. It's like the eel has a built-in remote control, using electricity not just to kill, but to manipulate. But how does such a bizarre creature evolve such a weapon? To answer that, we have to look at where it came from. The electric eel is a child of one of the most extreme arenas of evolution on Earth, the Amazon River Basin. These waters are murky, oxygen poor, and full of predators. To survive, the eel had to become something extraordinary. That's why it developed not only electricity, but also the ability to breathe air. Unlike most fish, electric eels must surface every few minutes to gulp oxygen using a mouth that works almost like a lung. This strange mix, part fish, part air breather, part living battery, was shaped by millions of years of adaptation in one of the harshest habitats on the planet. And for centuries, humans who encountered them were both terrified and fascinated. In fact, one scientist's painful encounter with an eel's shock inspired a discovery that changed human history. 
When European explorers first came across the electric eel, they couldn't believe what they saw. Here was a fish that could knock a horse off its feet or drop a grown man with a single jolt. Stories spread like wildfire, fueling both fear and fascination. But then came Alexander von Humboldt, a German naturalist in the early 1800s. While studying the eels, he watched locals drive horses into shallow water, where the eels attacked in a frenzy, shocking the animals until they collapsed. Humboldt himself later described the eel's power, and it stuck in the imagination of scientists back in Europe. In fact, these observations helped spark early experiments with electricity that would inspire inventions like the battery. The eel became a living symbol of nature's raw electrical power, proof that energy wasn't just human-made, but alive and swimming in the rivers of South America. Today, scientists are uncovering even more secrets of the electric eel, and the results are mind-blowing. Researchers have studied how the eel cells generate electricity, and they're using that blueprint to design bio-inspired batteries. Imagine tiny, flexible power sources that could one day power medical implants or wearable devices. Technology copied straight from this Amazon predator. What's more, the eel's ability to control prey with precise electrical pulses is inspiring robotics and neuroscience research. By mimicking the eel's remote control biology, engineers hope to unlock new ways of controlling machines or even understanding the brain's own electrical language. It's a reminder that this strange creature isn't just a deadly curiosity. It's a living key to future innovation. But despite all the wonder it brings, the electric eel's world is changing fast. For millions of years, the electric eel has ruled the rivers of South America. Shocking prey, inspiring fear, and fueling science. But today, its world faces threats it never evolved to handle. Deforestation, pollution, and human activity are reshaping the Amazon basin. As habitats shrink, the survival of this living battery hangs in the balance. Yet even as its future becomes uncertain, the electric eel reminds us of nature's raw genius. It's not just a predator, it's a glimpse into the power of evolution, a creature that turned danger into energy and survival into electricity. So the next time you plug in your phone, remember, long before humans wired the world, the rivers of the Amazon were already alive with power. And in those dark, murky waters, the electric eel still waits, silent, hidden, and ready to strike with lightning. If this short voyage into living lightning shocked your curiosity awake, do the animal kingdom a favor. Zap that like button, metaphorically, subscribe for more wild, weird, and wonderfully dangerous creatures, and drop a comment, what would you do if you accidentally met an electric eel in a river? Would you tiptoe away or stand your ground and become a viral cautionary tale? Share the scariest animal encounter you've ever had and we'll pick the best one for a future episode. Hit the comments and I'll shock you back with more. Stay curious, stay respectful, and for the love of rivers, maybe don't stick your toes into unknown water.